Catch-up weekend. It presents a rare Thursday night encounter. We're out at Kippen Park for Capital League 2 action between Western Spirit and Centenary Stormers. Western Spirit, they currently sit sixth on the table. Three points vital for them if they wish to make the tight final four for 2017. While for Centenary, they currently have a three-point lead over Virginia at the top of the table in Capital 2. Three points here would bring them closer to the clinching of the Premiership trophy. Philip Tracy is the referee for this one, assisted by Jaden Haynes and Christopher Sharkey. Two captains shake hands, and it's Western Spirit in their home yellow strip. Knocking it out of their defensive territory, Ashcroft. Ball played forward. Cut out by Khan. Full straight for Jarrett. Back for Jackson, who drives it in from distance. Centenary. Getting involved now is Klebo. At the corner of the box, and we've seen better efforts than that from uh, Joey Klebo. Appreciated the ball through, though. Shaklane Khan. Now Shahil Khan. Khan getting amongst the yellow shirts and shoots wide of the target. Morrill didn't need to get a hand on that one. Ashcroft out wider for Western Spirit. Once again, Jackson tipped by Crow. And looked like Centenary will try and get away with it here. Free kick taken by Donaldson. Rising high was Crow. Ball still alive for Western Spirit and eventually cleared away by Luke Martin. Now the centenary keeper, Brad Coe. Crow has remained down after that challenge. Now back to his feet. Looks like he'll continue. So now into the final minute before half-time whistle. Clebo. Just one in towards the left. Oh, it's spilt there by Morrill. Sh uh, Shohil Khan, I should say, goes down. And in the final minutes, Centenary Stormers are going to have the chance to go ahead here from the spots. And it'll be Shohil Khan to step up to take the kick. Oh, he's blazed it over the bar. Well, a golden opportunity for Centenary to take the lead. They're not able to do so. Nil all into the second half. And Crow gets its second bite of the cherry. Shahil Khan gets to the edge of the box. Pump of yellow shirts. Khan doing trying to break down the movement. And he goes down again. And this time the referee keeps the whistle by his side. Let's take a second look at that. There was a trailing foot from Brendan Ashcroft. Back heel by Mahanadic. Comes for Centenary again. And Morrill on hand. Jackson. Come Western Spirit. Can this deadlock finally be broken? It won't be that time round. Just over half an hour to play. Shahil Khan. Full sideways again. Patiently. Ruiz. And over the bar. Neither side with their shooting boots on this evening. Can't find the target. As I said in the opener, it's a match for both sides. It's vital to try and pick up three points from. Now from outside the box. Spirit bringing it into their attacking half. Going down was Dylan Goodman, it looked like. Discussion between Jake Schofield and the referee. Spirit free kick. Oh, Crow manages to tip it over the bar at the last moment. Let's take a second look at that. Didn't look to be 100% sure. Almost looked like it might dip in. 
Oh, great tackle there. They've been dispossessed. Centenary. And again, inaccurate finishing. Quarter of an hour to play. Still nil all. Morrill comes to it. Oh, he couldn't hold on to it. Clearance off the line. And Centenary. Unlucky not to score the first goal of this encounter. Morrill didn't get to it. Luke Martin's subsequent shot cleared off the line. Oh, that just about sums up the night, really, doesn't it? Mauricio Arena. Never in danger of troubling Brad Crow. As they build up, Western Spirit. Goal kick is the result. Throwing comes down the line in the fourth minute of stoppage time. Can it be Shahil Khan? Oh, once again, desperate on the line, Western Spirit. The keeper, Chris Morrill. Reflex save from Klebo. And it spills and eventually they get out of danger. Morrill, he's come deep off his line. Just going to allow a couple of seconds for... Shahil Khan to compose himself, but Morrill at the edge of the box. Fifth minute of stoppage time. Can Centenary finally make this pressure pay? No! And he can just see the frustration. Matthias Ruiz. Well, it's not been the night for either side. Centenary probably with the better of the chances, including that penalty that was missed. One point each, nil all in this round seven. Capital League 2 match.